We received this inquiry from Phyllis from Twani South College. It's an N3 mechanical drawing assembly consisting of nine parts, which is item one, the frame, item two, the V-belt pulley, item three, the flat belt pulley, item four, the bush, item five, the cover plate, item six, the shaft, item seven, eight is the locking pins, and item nine is M10 bolt. The parts are given in a first angle orthographic rejection, showing you all the details of item one, showing the front view and the left end view of the parts, your belts, the pulleys, and all the pins. The important part to remember of this is the what is your main primary view that you're looking at. In this case, item one is going to be the main component where all the other parts are attached to. So this is where you start your drawing and your most important section of the assembly. I've taken the liberty and modeled up all the parts as they've required. Item one being your frame, your shaft, your flat belt pulley, your V-belt pulley, the bush, the plate and the bolts. And there we have our two locking pins. The question that they're asking is to draw a full sectional front view of the assembly. The other two parts they require is the title and the scale below your drawing. That's carrying two marks. There is however one small little error on the question as you have an M10 bolt. Your tapped hole on your frame is an M10 but the cover plate has got a radius 4 bolt which gives you a diameter 8 hole so it won't fit. So I assume that would be an error and that would be a diameter 10 hole on that plate. The easiest way to figure out how to assemble these parts is look at common sizes. For example, we've got a 10 diameter shaft and on the flat belt pulley you have a diameter 10 hole. The shaft on the back end is a diameter 20 and the V-belt pulley has a diameter 20 hole. Similar to the bush has a 20 diameter hole which will fit in there. Um, look at the space in between the two tapped holes which should be the same on your cover plate. All right. This is basically the final drawing that they required, a full sectional front view, which means that all the components that are cut through need to be hatched. We do not hatch a shaft or fasteners or webs. In this case, the two pulleys are hatched, the bush is hatched, the cover plate and the frame is hatched. The bolt, you're not going to see it because the bolt is in the background, so you don't show hidden detail on a sectional view and the shaft we will show as if it's not cut because we don't cut a shaft. Any time you'll cut a shaft if you do a partial cut away to show a keyway or a bolt in detail. The other two parts I require is the title and the scale below it. The title will be 5mm text, the scale will be 3mm text. Um, so Phyllis, I hope this answers your question and happy drawing.